Hello Kulas and welcome back to Viva Barca, the home of everything Barcelona, where we are going to be discussing on some interesting updates. We start with Memphis Depay, who according to latest report, Barca are sweating on his fitness so that he can be available against Atletico Madrid this coming weekend. We are going to be discussing much on that as we progress. Then secondly, talking about Adama Traore, as recently President Juan Laporta have assured Traore that the club counts on him beyond six months. Of course, we know he was loaned for six months, but Laporta have made it clear that they count on him even above or beyond the six month period. We are going to be discussing much on that as well. So guys, as we get right into it, please make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed. Give this video a like and make sure to watch this video right up to the very end. Barca, Barca, Barca. Barcelona are still sweating on a key injury doubt ahead of Sunday's key clash with Atletico Madrid. Barca are preparing for a huge clash in their bid to land a top 4 spot this season. Xavi Hernandez's men face Atletico Madrid, who are one of Barca's biggest rivals in the race to finish the top 4. The two sides are separated by just one point, with Atletico currently having an upper hand. But ahead of the clash at the Camp Nou, Barca are sweating on the fitness of Memphis Depay. Memphis has struggled to stay fit over the last month or so, and he is facing a, a race against time to return ahead of, his, of this weekend match. The Dutchman returned to training on Monday evening, but he is not working with a group as detailed by Sport. Memphis is working on an individual basis with um, the aim of returning ahead of this weekend game, but he is by no means guaranteed to return in time. Thankfully for Barca, they will have Ferran Torres and Adama Traore available. Then on to the next story of discussion. One of the biggest surprises of Barcelona's winter transfer window was the return of Adama Traore to the club. The striker was far from his best form in the Premier League, but Barca felt he could add depth to their squad given his La Masia route. According to reports from Sport, Joan Laporta was critical, or let was crucial in the loan deal of the winger from Wolf. The club president convinced Traore that he would be a valuable asset to the team and explained the merits of the operation. Moreover, he is also said to have assured the player that it would not just be a six-month loan and that they count on him for the future too. The report come as a surprise as the contract to be signed by Traore is only for a period of six months with a non-mandatory purchase clause of 30 million euros. If the club really believe in the longer commitment of the player, the, the clause should have been made mandatory. The former Wolverhampton player joined his first training session yesterday where he was treated to a warm welcome by both players and Javi. Traore is expected to compete with Usman Dembele for a starting spot on the right wing. Of course, if the club does not give the Frenchman the letter of freedom after he refused to leave or renew his contract. With his pace and dribbling being the highlight of his game, Traore promises to bring a lot of verticality into the team's play. Further, the arrival of Aubameyang will help Traoré's integration for the Gabonese striker provides the perfect profile to bury the chances created by him. Traoré has already been officially registered with the team and can make his debut against Atletico Madrid in La Liga at the weekend. So coolers, with that we come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching, hope you did enjoy the video and also hope you did subscribe. If you haven't, please make sure to do so, so you always stay in touch with the latest on FC Barcelona here on Viva Barca. Until next time. Bye-bye.